Hey guys, welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Hidden Order. My name is Twitchy, playing the role of my boy Cal here, and I'm gonna say we have just taken down the Ninth Sister. Give it some, yeah. I am on the Wookiee home planet of Kajit. I was looking for my boy Tarful. He was a big Wookiee chief chieftain, but we found him, and he showed us the way to this big origin tree. Something to do with connecting the planet with the sky, or say, sounds like um. Uh, spiritual wishy-washy nonsense to me, I say as a Jedi. Um, but yeah, we made our way up there. We found this astrium, which somehow leads us to all the Jedi younglings. Yes, because trying to find the younglings is never going to be a problem, is it? No, no, indeed. Uh, uh, whilst doing that, the Ninth Sister found us, but we were like, bah! and very easily, very, very easily took her on. Definitely didn't have to take an entire episode and something like six fights to try and get it done. Right now, we're trying to make our way back to the Mantis, which I only know is back this way. Maybe we'll find some shortcuts somewhere. Maybe not, but we can see those over there. And oh, hey, how's it going, guys? No, no, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> what's, what's the pushback button? I can't remember. Let's just let's just go, go, go nuts with the double, uh, double-ended uh, lightsaber here. Wow, a lot, lot of ours already. Let's keep moving on, though, and find out what we can do. I'm wondering whether we can actually just Hey, this is like web. Who's firing web at me? I was about to say, I'm wondering whether we can just like take a cup, but there's a lot, seems to be a lot of things around here, so I'm gonna carry on going. Hey, buddy, get off. Um, oh, here's the, here's that spider. Okay, yeah, let's let's fight this guy. How's it going, man? You you wanna you wanna get some uh, bees? All the bees, if you can. Hopefully, this guy shouldn't be too much trouble to just be up, right? I mean, we we literally just took on the night sister. Uh, I don't know what we're gonna. What what, 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 did this could even do to um, like trouble us? That web attack is a bit of a thing, but it doesn't look like I've even taken a hit of damage. Shouldn't say that. The moment I say that, you know it all goes wrong. Okay, so we've got some stormtroopers. Is there even a stormtrooper? Oh, hey, it's, I'll just hide over here for now. I'm uh, gonna wait for him to run out of ammo. I was gonna be like, oh, there's even one of those uh, minigun stormtroopers. Ah, let's just get in there and beat him up. Get out of here. All right, cool. Beautiful. Wonderful. Now we can start being a little bit more elegant about what we're doing. Uh, I hold up my uh, my block here. Yeah, like that. That's cool. That's um, what happened to the parries. There we go. Pa oh, foodie woo. What are we foodie wooing at? This? What is this? Tell me. Give me some words. The All-Terrain Armored Transport, or the Imperial Walker, is the backbone of the Empire's Assault Armored Division. A quadrupedal multi-troop transport deployed for heavy ground force assault. <sighs> words. They are most often used to eliminate insurgent threats and enforce Imperial occupation throughout the galaxy. They're equipped with a host of formidable offensive capabilities, including chin-mounted, chin yep, chin-mounted long-range heavy blaster cannons, as well as side cannons and blast impervious armor plating. Ooh, that was a lot of words there that meant, you know, basically what they were saying afterwards. Ah, but I mean unnecessary words. All right, let's move down over this way and see if we can find... I've got a wall run to go through. I'm wondering whether we're going to actually find anywhere that we have been before. I don't actually know where we're going. Oh, hey, who are you? You're a purge trooper. Uh, I'm going to go this way and kind of not worry about him. Uh, you know, purge troopers shouldn't be a problem. Let, let's be honest here. They should not be a problem. Okay, we've already gone in and got this. Oh, that is dark. That's why I couldn't see what was going on there. Let's jump down there. Uh, uh, do, we, do we even think this is the way we're supposed to be going? Let's just take a moment. Yeah, this is the way we're supposed to be going, but I uh, really feel like there should be a faster way. Uh, so we're going to go up here, across, and somehow into that. That's my plan. Ooh, man, it's been a while since we've been here. It has been a while. Who knows what horrors... Mm, horrors we're gonna have. Let's jump up and over. Hey, buddy, how you... No, 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 that's not the getting quick button. Okay, there we go, cool. Uh, the purge trooper is down there. I would totally feel remiss if I didn't fight him, so I'll catch him later. All right, what, where, where is it we're going here? There are definite directions we need to go. Yeah, please, if I can go up here. Oh, uh, yeah, all right, big old lift. Normally, we get some sort of... Uh, cutscene in the lift, but doesn't look like anybody wants to talk to me today. This makes me sad. We are on our way to Dathomir, if people don't know. That is the uh, planet of death. Uh, supposedly strong Sith presence over there, but it is a place where an Astrium exists. And as Cordova took the one from here, I suppose it would make sense if we went... I heard something. Okay. It would make sense if we went and did... Oh, if we went and got it, you know, if we went and got the other one. Hey, it's kind of been our entire goal so far. You, you're kidding, right? You're kidding. You, you really want to come in and have a have a pop like that? I I don't I don't think this is really going to work out for you, to be honest, mate. Okay. Oh, oh, oh I really thought I'd had him. I thought I'd finished him off. Do you mind? 
I don't I don't think he actually minds. Look, did we get out of here? There we go. That that guy was a lot tougher to fight than he should have been. Oh hello, that's something I've never seen before. Okay, so we are like right here. We're the two steps on from where I was last talking to you guys. Uh, did you did you ever see that? I never saw that before. We're gonna go check it out. I'm not sure how we get back up here, but we're gonna find out. Uh, hi, how's it going? Am I now stuck here never to be able to get back? Well, let's sense this echo. It's a Wookiee. Which Wookiee is this? Uh, if we could keep this... This Wookiee died from toxic fumes. The Empire is poisoning the planet. No, not the planet. Can I climb up there? Is that a thing I can do? The Wookiee died from toxic planet. One of the many side effects from a refining process. The Empire is slowly destroying everything on this planet. Where do I... How do we get out of here now? Now that I've got myself down here. I mean, like, I want to say that, but I just don't seem to be able to grab it, you know? Okay, so I threw myself off the edge. That seemed to work out all right for us. Okay, where are we going? We are going along and up. Let's let's get over there. Let's go see what's going on in the Mantis. The, uh, oh, oh, hey, 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 hey. Uh, we, fa we faced this before. We have faced this before. We've got ourselves a couple of bounty hunters. Okay, this should be fine. No problem. No problem. Uh, I don't know how exactly... We're going to get this done, but doing it is going to be a thing. Let's move. Let's move. If we could not... Oh, oh, oh. Let's, let's get out of there. That seemed like some sort of stun grenade, but I am about that. These guys look like they're trying to say that they're immune to it. Oh, hey, hey. Let's, let's get out of this way. I am patching myself up. I'm also trying desperately to avoid the... Uh, the fact that the, those stun grenades, that's what I'm trying to say. The stun grenades are what I'm trying to avoid here. Okay, did I put them out of their misery for a little time? Uh, more, 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 more healing. More healing. It's a, it's a thing. Need the heals. Okay, we're down. We are out and about. This, this is looking all right, I suppose. It's going to take a little bit longer to do than I would like. If we take this guy down. Oh. Hey, hey, no. Does that mean the other guy runs away? That's one of them. Okay, this is good. I've got to heal though. I've got to heal. Okay, that's the healing. What is that? It's a what? It's a it's a flash bomb. Okay, is this guy going to be relatively easy to take out? That's the question here. Uh, not like that. He won't be. I mean, he says clipped him. I actually really. Yeah, actually, I do feel pretty hurt here, buddy. Can we just finish him up? Is that a thing? I need to duck. Uh, not duck. I need to dodge more. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like that. Can we just finish him off? That's the question. Not like that. I'm not. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jump. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, that was close. That was, like, super close. Unfortunately. Oh, fortunately. Uh, we... <laughs> I mean, I'm nearly dead. I think that's what I'm trying to say here. I'm nearly dead. But I did get myself a nice little skill point there. Frequently makes his blast of fire, flashbang grenade, shield attacks, and repulsor blast. Engage with caution. Their shield protects against lightsaber attacks, but only when activated. Commandos are among the muscle of the vile criminal gang, the Haxian Brood. You know, those pirates that, that abducted us. Crawling from the seediest corners of the galaxy, bounty hunters of this variety are infamous for their violent reputation. Uh, augmented with smuggled droid parts, they are unwavering combatants who combine superior skills with a deadly arsenal. Wow, what about this guy? Uh, this is another one that was coming to, coming to have us. Freely combines blaster fire missiles and flamethrower. Engage with caution. Oh, uh, wait, this is the guy that we fought earlier on with the jetpack on the other planet. Yeah, okay, we're not going to read that again, but uh, hey, we've got... We've got one more of them to face. One more of those to face at some point. It's going to be tough. It's going to be tough, especially as the fact that I'm nearly dead right now. But how do we get home? It's uh, up and around this way. Okay, that's that's cool. Uh, uh, I kind of... This. This right here is what I want. Okay, let's come along here and interact with that. Hey, do you see all that in the background? Remember when we were over there watching all that stuff go down? I do. I do. Everbridge Farm remembers. Okay, where are we going? We're going over here. Get on this ladder and uh, lift. Sorry. Let's see what uh, what's up above. I'm almost expecting an early death. Look at me. I am. I am. Let's get, let's get my my block out just in case. Okay, I think we're good for now. Yeah. Okay. So whilst I run, I instinctively block. It's one of the skills that I have picked up. Uh, okay, looking good. Is this? Let's have a look. Yeah, this is. Okay, so somewhere in here, there should be a way of movement. There we go. Let's go and have a look at the Mantis and see what's going on over there. Ooh, half an episode, just a travel. Love it, love it. All right, what's going on over here? 
forest trench. Yeah, I, I know this is the forest trench. Ah, oh, so that's the bit down that way where actually we've picked up all the secrets. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's go out and let's have a look at the mantis. Get my block out. Expecting a second sister at some point. I, I should imagine not, actually, to be honest. We've literally just taken down the ninth sister, so uh, bringing the second sister to us at this point would be a little over the top, don't you think? All right, hi, I'm looking for Grease and Siri. Is she about? Hello? Hey, right, guys. How's it going? Cordova believed the key to the vault is on Dathomir. You find your Wookiee? Yep. Things are bad down there. Do you not think I would? Empires everywhere. Inquisitors? There was. Trilla. The second sister is gone for now, but she's still chasing us. Yep. Do you reckon I was supposed to be facing Trevor at that sister. point? Oh, there we go. <laughs> you know, just casual. Defeated her. Doesn't say, like, how defeated, but, you know, defeated. Just threw her off the tree. Uh, yeah, you got something to say? I was captured by the Empire. Yep. I resisted. Uh-huh. I swore to myself that I would die before I would talk. But... But then this dark shadow came, and he was worse than any nightmare I could have imagined. And I still fought, but in the end, I came apart, and I gave them Trilla. And I know there's nothing I can do to make that right. No, not at all. But Cal, there's still a chance we can save the others on the holocron. Hey, look, the Ninth Sister said something about becoming an Inquisitor, like. I think it's inevitable. But you went through the same thing she did, and you didn't join them. Cal. It's okay, Seer. We'll find Cordova's holocron. Yeah, I don't like it, but it's understandable. Hey, Chill. Get your lasers off my lunch. <laughs> He's like, too much salt, man. You gotta be cool. Cool. You gotta be cool. Shall we read Seri's past? I think we should read Seri's past. Cal learned Siri lied, hiding that her former Padawan Trilla is the second sister. When Siri was tortured by the Empire, she was forced to betray Trilla. The Empire then captured Trilla and turned her into an Inquisitor. Siri, devastated, used the dark side of the Force in order to escape. Fearful she would slip back into the dark, Siri vowed never to use the Force again. Yeah, that's, um, that's some pretty serious stuff. Let's we'll see if talk, she's got anything. Maybe. We'll talk. Like, well, then why even give me that option? Why even? Right, did we pick any of these up whilst we were out? We did. We picked two of them up. Beautiful, beautiful. All about those new seeds. Uh, let's pan left and right and see what's going on. Royal Fuzz, Gilly Pod, Milk, Grass, and Mush Bloom. That sounds amazing. All right, cool, wonderful. Uh, let's, uh, let's make our way to Dathomir, shall we? I've got a feeling we're going to have some bad times out there, um, or something like that. Let's, uh, just quickly have a look around one last time at the green lushness. All right, that's enough. Let's get out. BD didn't follow me out. That's a bit crazy. That's a bit crazy. I was about to use the holo table, but I noticed Grease over here. Hey, you got Someone's those? in here. But in here, I mean, so I see, but aren't you supposed to be in the toilet when you say stuff like that? Maybe, uh, maybe I'm misinterpreting something here. Okay, use the holocron. Let's see what's going down here. Ready to move? Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? We're going to, uh, not to Zepho, but to Dathomir. All right, we're definitely going to travel to this planet. We have been here right, once before. It was dangerous. It was scary. We had, we went and had a look and then we ran away Shut with uh, tails between our legs. Wait a minute. You want to go to Dathomir? Yeah, man, you know. I'm surprised Cordova went there. He must have had good reason. Must have. I am staying put on the Manus once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. Any this sunlight is not good for your skin, to be fair. Powerful cabal of Force wielders known as the Night Sisters. Yeah. They use the Force? What, like Jedi? No. Sort of. These witches served only themselves. Their powers focused on deception, illusion. Manipulation. Totally not Jedi ways. Sounds like someone I used to know. No. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Oh, Sith. Death and Can't deal a with them. Place. We should be careful. You don't have to tell me twice. Night Sisters of Dothamir. The Night Sisters of Dothamir were a coven of powerful, force sensitive, skilled in the use of magic. An expression of the force unknown to Sith or Jedi. They previously ruled Dathomir. Night Sisters society was strictly matriarchal, with the Coven answering to the Mother, who also ruled the lower Night Brother classes. Their civilization was destroyed at the behest of a vengeful Count Dooku after Az Azaj, Ventress, and her sisters attempted to assassinate him. Okay, so, I mean, look, that's not really betraying their trust. Destination. Grab some seed, kid. 
I mean, you know, if if they tried to kill the Sith Lord and then the Sith Lord was like, nah, 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 that's not really betraying trust, you know? I, I, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm wrong there. Maybe I've got this wrong. All right, here we go. Arriving at a new planet. Oh, it's gonna, look at it. It's bright red. It's going to be trouble. You just know it. Look at those faces in the wall. Why would you even put them there? They are terrifying. Terrifying. More importantly, why do the Mantis have this third engine in such a weird place that, like, swivels around and stuff. I don't, I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. All right, let's get out and have a look. Indoors. I got walls. I got Jedi. I'm fine. Yeah, you're fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're fine, mate. Don't don't worry. Where even is he? Hey, man. How you doing? Yeah, hey, Cal. You... you and her. Is everything all right? Yeah, as far as I'm no, aware. No. That's not what's important right now. Is it not? You know, Seer believes in you. And to tell you the truth, I didn't really think that much of you at first. I noticed. I mean... She got me to follow you to the scariest place in the galaxy, so... Yeah, yeah, man, whatever. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Is well, it the I scariest place in the galaxy? I sort this thing out soon so we can finish this quest and go relax somewhere. I know a great castle on Taco Donna that makes the best bloody rancors in the galaxy. I mean, to be fair, that sounds pretty good. What else so, you got? Looks like Sork Tormo really wants a piece of you. <laughs> you don't know the half of it, kid. How'd you ever get involved with that guy? Yeah, like, legit. Look, I didn't grow up with much. I mean, I had my great-grandmother to lean on, but that's it. You had to know it wouldn't end well with gangsters like the Haxian Brood. Cal, we ain't all Jedi. Most of us got to scrape by and occasionally make some bets we wish we had. Why would you bet? I understand. You can count on me if the Brood comes after you again. Yeah? Huh. Thanks, Cal. Yeah, Jedi protection. here? What? Is this a trick question? You want me to go outside and find her for you? Yeah. No, it's okay. I'll find her. Could you? You though? gotta quit messing with me, Cal. I mean, I'm tough, but fragile. Tough, but fragile. Not now. I got work to do. <laughs> All right, that, that's everything he's got to say about this. Oh, Cal, hey, Siri. You've come a long way since Bracca, but the path is far from over. I want you to know the difficult challenges ahead. I can handle it. I know what you can do. I'm not denying that. And I know what has to be done. I've done it before. Oh, have you, though? Cal, even the strongest of Jedi... I'm not Trilla. I'll be fine. I know you're not. I didn't say that. Yeah, that's not what we're on about. asking you to say anything. It's okay, Seer. Really. Just be safe, Cal. That's all. She's trying to give you some proper life advice. You're like, no, 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 no. I'm hey, better than that. I know we haven't been on great terms, but can I talk to you about something? Oh, is this going to be great? Uh, I need your help. I'm listening. I've reconnected with the Force, but I still feel blocked. Blocked. Why do you think that is? Every time I open myself up, I see Master T'Pol. You felt this, yet you've continued deepening your connection to the Force. You know what that says to me? What does that say? I don't know what's good for me. That you're strong enough to embrace your emotions. Give yourself time. Seer, I... Thanks for helping me. It means a lot. I have been a sort of drift in the world. I can understand why he would be totally about that. All right, one last still talk. hiding? It appears so. I don't blame him. Dathomir is not kind to outsiders. It's not, is it? Bravo must have said something about this place to you. Something to explain why he came here. Why would he? It's dangerous. You think he was any more clear then than he is on those logs he left behind? He was always a smart man, but he was still figuring things out. Now it's up to us to follow that path. All right, I, I got that. Is that all your talk? Sorry, let's have a look here. Let's see what's going on. We got a little something to jump over there, and I'm not sure if there are any safe points going on, so I... Thing. Yeah, let's let's go have a quick look. Let's go have a look. We got like five minutes, rather than stop five minutes early. We're gonna go uh, fight some. Ah! I think we weren't standing there. Yeah, we weren't standing there. I was running at it full hog though. What is that? Look at him. What are we supposed to do about it? I mean, no, I'm not gonna count on him being friendly. But is it something that I'm gonna have an easy fight with or a tough fight with? That's the real question. All right, up at the top. Can I not look over? It's not letting me look over. Okay, there he is. All right, this is fine. Let's. Uh, I'm trying to... Uh, there we go. That's what I'm trying to do. All right, he's off over that way. I'm going to just run around and see if there's anything we want to take advantage of. Let them fight it out. Bam, 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 bam. Run away now. Yeah, I got half... Oh, he, he got at least one solid hit on me there. But I think we'll be okay as long as I keep moving and dodging and yeah that bug's gonna have him go on yeah let's let's tick that 
He's not. He's not about it. Uh, just block. Yes. Dathomir is the most dangerous place in the galaxy. Bye bye, lightsaber's blade. I think not. All right, that's cool. What have we got here? A lesser Nadak. Uphold a strong defense against its aggressive or relentless attacks. That was what I was forgetting to do. Easily thrown off by repeated parries. Referred to in Legends as the Scourge of Dathomir, this deadly lesser Nadak is an agile and highly aggressive alpha predator. Its carnivorous appetite and relentless pursuit of prey make it de a deadly foe to nearly all life forms. Powerful arms allow it to traverse terrain in diverse and unparalleled methods. It often surprises its quarry. Oh, hey, this is, uh, this is an open. Let's see what happens. The door is locked from the other side. I guess this is the way that we're going to be coming down at some point. I literally just want to have a quick explore of this. Oh, hey, what have we got over Always here? Always finding stuff. Always finding stuff. Is it is it another thing that we can go... Oh, That's mushlings. Good. I don't mind if I do. Mushlings are an essential ingredient in the ink Night Sisters and Night Brothers use for their tattoos. The mushling pods are boiled down until they become thick yellowish paste. From there, clay, ash, or other pigments are mixed in to create a variety of colors. Sounds beautiful, actually, to be honest. Look at that. What? What is this? What is it? Can I... No, it doesn't do me damage, and I can't attack it. So that is a thing. All right, a quick look around, see if there's a... I'm particularly looking for a save point somewhere. You know, that, that I think, would be very handy at some point. Also wondering where... Way do you mind? Thanks. Also wondering where we go up. Uh, this is another scan. I guess right now we're just going in for the biology of the local environment, right? Capable uh, of launching ranged attacks of venomous saliva. Upon death, corpse will emit a toxic acid. We literally just found that out. The vile bane back spider is a venomous foe to be reckoned with. Primarily a hole dweller, they are known to scatter and climb with agility. When encountered, they can project venomous saliva at enemies with a range of up to 12 meters. Woo. Caution to be taken if they're killed due to the emission of a toxic acid will pull out from their corpse upon death. Yep, we found that. Look how look how nearly dead I am. Uh, okay, nothing down here to look at, though honestly, I kind of want to jump down there. Uh, keep moving around. I'm even tempted to head back to the Mantis at this point. What did he just foodie woo at? Down here, mate? Is this, is this what we're looking? What you got? Yeah. Show me. Tell me. What is it? The hydratus grows in a dry, rocky area. The air is filtered through its filaments with uh, trapped dust and bacteria. Once filtered, the filaments contract to look a lot clean air inside, creating a humid environment where the hydratus can absorb a small amount of water it needs to survive. Yeah. Let me see. All right, beautiful. Beautiful. But I think with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time when we're going to explore this area in its entirety, as opposed to just kind of running around and seeing what the local environments have to offer. Is that something scary behind me? Can I turn around? I mean, the scary might be a bit strong. We got it. We took it down. Uh, I will see you guys next time when we're going to explore this entire area. I'm going to try and find my way back onto the Mantis if I can, and I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye.